We need to become invincible in Minecraft Hardcore, and the easiest way for us to do that is using these villagers, and I'm just gonna go ahead and use this lectern to bring him back to my house. If you insist on being a fisherman, then I'll just put you in a boat and I'll bring you back to my house myself. Alright, after that very long journey, now we can just go ahead and drop him down here, where I have already trapped another villager. Well, our first objective, we have to turn these guys into an infinite amount of villagers, so let's get started with that, shall we? Oh, sweet, there's so many mobs down here. Ah! Okay, there's a redstone torch, powered rails, a dispenser, normal rails. Now we need a button. Okay, button. The final thing? The final thing was the button. Okay. Jump. Oh my god, he actually went up there. Since I live a boring life, I'm going to let these guys sit here for like an hour or two while I go AFK, so let's just see what happens. And we're back, it's been a little bit while I was kind of made a basic king totem, but ignoring that... Uh... Why is there no villagers? Well, I guess that means I gotta get new villagers. Can I roll in? I can. And boom. All right, we got those two guys for real this time. <sighs> I'm gonna leave them alone for an hour and see what happens. check on the little villagers oh my god yo oh my god <laughs> how many villagers are there and before we get into anything i do want to find a little bit more food because you know there's only so much i can do with one cook's chicken so okay we still have so much to do in this episode so you see these guys well they need a place to stay so why don't we just go ahead and build them a little bunker well before we build a bunker we gotta make sure the area is safe by building a fence and then we should also probably place down some torches to make sure no mobs can spawn and when that's all done we should be able to start building the bunker So I did a little bit of mining off camera and now we got to decorate it and I don't want to waste your time of course so uh and we're good oh my god I just spent the last three hours doing this so I made a bit of progress while we've been gone I didn't want to show you all but I've been chopping trees went through all of my iron but while I've been building we have some more villagers you might be thinking oh that doesn't look like that many villagers well let me just come down here we have a few more. <laughs> now my plan for these villagers is to turn them into Fletchers, and in order to do that, we need to get some flint. All right, let's just do it. All right, with all of this flint, I can go ahead and make all my workbenches, and now is the fun part.
While the Fletchers might have taken me about 30 minutes to get them all together, I had no idea how long the librarians were about to take. Let's just say two hours of my life went by so slowly. Please, 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 please. Oh my god, we actually got it. Oh, for 17 emeralds too, that's so good. We're starting to run quite low on the basic materials, and uh, in order to remain the absolute prestige in this world, I need- Oh god, why are the price is so high? I need to gather a bunch of sticks and the other basic materials in order to survive. So let's do that. After doing all that trading and getting everything all prepared and ready, we have 48 levels. With those 48 levels, I think it would be smart to try and get some fortune and go- Huh, well isn't that perfect. Oh. My. God. Oh my god, we got two in a row? I guess we just go ahead and go strip mining. All right, all together we got 28 diamonds. That'll be plenty. Now we just gotta do some enchanting. Perfect, I got all of my mending. Okay, we have just about every book we need. <sighs> okay, well, before we do anything, I need to go on an iron run so I can get myself an anvil. So, BRB. Oh my god, that was a good trip. I love fortune so much. Boom, three anvils crafted up with iron despair. That's how we roll. And let's get these enchantments going. First things first, all of my stuff needs to have unbreaking. Next, I want to give myself some mending because our armor and everything else is pretty badly damaged. After camping out for a couple nights, I got enough gunpowder to make 23 TNT, so... Okay, let's build our nether portal. There's not really a specific spot I want to put this, so I'm just going to put it like right here. Okay, here we go. It is time to enter the nether. Let's go. Oh my god. We're actually here. Oh god. Good thing we have all that protection. Jeez. I mean, that's a pretty good demonstration. I mean, we sat in that lava for a couple seconds and it barely even hurt us. Oh my god, I was <laughs> I'm literally just making a line so I can place it on TNT and I already found some. Thank you. Already got two in the bag. Oh my god, we found more. Okay, let's see what we find. And boom, five netherite ingots. Oh, this is exciting. Now we can go ahead and make ourselves a smithing table. Oh my God. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, 
Episode 2 of Minecraft Hardcore. We did it. We are now invincible. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Adios, gamers.